we live in a growing city with a growing population and that's put a lot of pressure on the price of housing and the chart on the right the really important thing there is no rental housing is being built any of the growth that I'm going to talk about is going to be met by pre-construction condominiums and if you compare the bottom line here is the cost of a condominium versus a detached on the top the spread has just been getting bigger over the last 10 years and there isn't more land, that trend is going to continue. So for investors, it also makes it the most affordable option. If you want to buy a multiplex property, you're into the millions typically. So that's why condos have become the new rental solution. 77,000 condos were used as rental properties last year. 43% of all new construction condominiums are going to be used as rentals. And really what this is all about is the population growth that we're seeing. So the population is driving the rental rates. So we've got very low vacancy rates in the downtown core, it's less than 1%. When we, when we get these units back, everyone wants a brand new condo. We sometimes get multiple offers on the day or within a few days of having it listed. And the value of rents have been growing up at a rate of 4%.